Hi, Cybert Spruce here, back with another Answer Our Dimensions New Game Minus Minus video, episode 47, and it's been weeks since last episode I've grinded to as much Eternity points as I can get, E87, actually, longer runs can work out, I mean, maybe it's slower, but you don't constantly need to be, you know, have the computer on this game and this tab and everything, so, I did get all the way up to the 4.44 E87 upgrade there so it seems to be going up by 50 rather than um 25 i'm maybe it's probably it's, i'm guessing it's because of my just it's probably some scaling that happens it may have been in, even in the vanilla game like around those points but yeah e87 attorney points i haven't even gotten any of these time dimension upgrades i should probably you know get them i'll, I'll just start with the cheapest and just get to the progressively more expensive upgrades. Just get everything I can get here. I mean, it's not really gonna make a difference this run, but especially if we do it, if we grab these eternity points and then keep getting more and more of these upgrades. And this is all I can do here. So at least we got something. We can see the galaxy points. I, I feel like that's a new record. It's, it's not enough to get this upgrade. We also, wait. Crap. There is time theorems I forgot to get. Ah. Uh, I'm an idiot sometimes. I mean I can get I can get a bunch from eternity points like this. And also I didn't okay, I didn't get this. I maybe that's fine. I don't know. It's not the biggest deal in the world, but not getting those time theorems was okay, maybe it wasn't that big of a deal because they got 20 time theorems. I think what at this point I'm just gonna Start trying to do some more challenges because, yeah, we're we're still really <laughs> struggling with this. So I'm gonna start with Eternity Challenge Two. Um, I guess I can just use this build and actually I'll go active, and I should use infinity infinity dimensions instead of time dimensions, apparently, or at least that's what people are telling me. So I'll do that. Let's let's see what I can do with this. I can get all the way up to 181 with this. And can I get the required amount of infinity points? So, well, oh yeah, galaxy upgrades. Remember to get them. That like this is these this is the most OP thing in the entire thing. So now when we're getting our you know, replicated galaxies. We're not even close to E2125 infinity points though. Even though we have all the galaxy points we can get. Um, oh wait, it's probably because I didn't read the challenge. It's infinity dimensions are disabled, so we do not want this path. Um, exit challenge. Idiots. <laughs> Just respec. Um, let's go time dimension. That's probably good. I may also try normal dimensions. But we'll try time dimensions here. Um, so I'll just get all of these. Go back to you and get all the galaxy upgrades. And then once I get all of those, let's see how far I can get. This doesn't look very promising. It's like a hundred more orders of magnitude of infinity points. That's it. Yeah, this challenge is definitely impossible. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna try one more thing and this is going normal dimension path, but no. Even with, you know, you gain Replicanti three times faster, it's just not enough. Even with all this, we just need way more of just everything. Because you can see here, normal dimension path may actually be the best out of all of this. It's getting me the farthest, but still nowhere near where I actually want to be <laughs> in <clears throat> terms of of infinity points so this is an impossible challenge what if we go to eternity challenge one so we you know respec just go to these um let's go normal dimension path because that seemed to be the most successful there um, so let's let, let's let's see how far we can get here and i need e 3400 infinity points Hope this is possible. Doesn't look 
all it doesn't look promising from this. Yeah, it is this this also looks impossible. I'm even farther away from the goal here, so I mean I guess I can try just going with time dimension path. But there's not much else I can do here. Attorney Challenge 1 reward is also really weak, so. Yeah, we're just gonna try one more time. Um, because we, we really need to try just to see if I can get any kind of progression going in New Game Minus Minus. But no, I, this is already impossible. So, what about, let's say, Attorney Challenge 5? I don't even know what that one is. It's. it's well, what is what is this? Galaxy cost increase scaling starts instantly. Let's just go infinity dimension active for this. So I don't, I don't even need to press R this whole time here. And we have enough time theorems to just get everything we want. Um, just get this, get this, and get this. We need e eighteen hundred infinity points. Get all of our galaxy upgrades, and this is. Definitely closer. It's still not very close though. Like you can see even with this. I'm still at I'm still 300 orders of magnitude too low. And even like I could, you know, abuse the idle path. I'm actually gonna be away from my computer for like the next 20 days out of this recording. So I definitely can afford to wait. And just get like, you know, a ton of infinity points that way. But it's not going to be enough infinity points. I mean, maybe I can go infinity dimension idle. I mean, I don't know. T I'll do time dimension idle just to see here. But I doubt it's going to be enough for anything here. Unfortunately. There's nothing I can really do. That's the problem. So, yeah, go here. Go, go into this and get all the galaxy upgrades and um i mean the, the replica yeah replicanti is still really slow but you can see mm, well actually that one replicated galaxy did quite a bit so maybe you can afford to wait i don't know it's, it still does not seem promising at all nope I, I'm, just, I'm just gonna quit it here this is impossible, unfortunately. I mean, I could, I could try to go normal dimension path, but I don't really feel like it would do anything. So yeah, let's just, I don't know, I'll, I'll try it just because. But I know it's not gonna get me anywhere. Yeah, I'm even lower in infinity points than before. So I'm just gonna exit this. So these are impossible. I could try to go for four again, but. I feel like I got four the first time by a low margin. Let's try six, where you can't gain galaxy normally, but okay, yeah, it's the one that forces you to go active path. Um, so let's see, I'll first do infinity dimension active. So just get this. I need the replicated galaxies to get the challenge, so I'll just hold R the whole time. I'm, I'm, I don't know, I, I, might, I might have done this like, last episode as well just like try to do all of the you know eternity challenges come on 45 replicant of galaxies to get this and then i only need e1075 infinity points for it so oh yeah this is possible boom we've done it let's see how far we can go actually is the reward any good um, oh, it's this one. Reduce the dimension cost of multiplier increase. That might be really good. I'm not sure how good it is, but it seems pretty good. So we, we can get all the way up to around E1250 eternity points with that. So, ooh, E1300. I could try to abuse, like, you know, the active path thing for it. I, I'm, I'm going to try it. I'm not sure if it's possible. But we're going for it. Because I was 45 orders of magnitude away last time. And I didn't really have any kind of optimization with it. 
And yeah, 50 Ripple County Galaxies is is just just a little bit of a weight here. Okay, we have it now, so we can get this and um, yeah, so it's yes, the up, cost of upgrading your max replicated galaxies is massively reduced. So first get the galaxy upgrades and then just, you know, buy the Replicanti galaxies. And I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to make it to E1300. It's definitely gonna be close. I mean, I, I feel like if I can, you know, abuse 141 and like using, you keep, you keep half of your Replicanti galaxies on infinity. You can see here E1265 and maybe I can get more with this. Now, this actually doesn't look all that promising. I mean, yes, I can get a few more orders of magnitude, but it's just not quite enough for E1300. Like, even with this, E127, I, I can't get any more than E1280. I'm that close. So, I mean, I could try a different path, but I'm just gonna try a different challenge at this point. So, let's, let's try Attorney Challenge. I remember seven being really, I don't know, I'll do seven. Um, maybe it'll be easier now. Um, I don't, I don't know what, where, where is seven? It's this one. So, and still you don't get 181 and all that um, with it. I'll just go Infinity Dimension Active just to see where I, what I can do here and Get this, and I need E1980 infinity points. Is this going to be possible? Oh, this actually does look possible. Um, I don't think I'm not going to be able to get to the next completion of this because it's it's kind of cutting it close, but it is possible. Like I can get up to E1999 infinity points, and as what what's the next completion? E2510. No, thank you. <laughs> this is as far as I can get. Um, what about Tourney Challenge 8? You can only upgrade Infinity Dimensions 50 times. Oh yeah, this one. Um, so I think I think I'm forced to go idle here. Um, so yeah, that's that. Um, I guess I'll just do Infinity Dimensions because that's what people say is the best. I don't know. Um, I'll just go idle and this. I need. Infinity points. So let's see if this is possible. And an E2600 infinity points for this. And, um, okay. This is a little dicey. I mean, remember, I already have these, so I don't really need any of these upgrades. I mean, I think they're super weak. Look, if I get, I'll, I'll just one of them for show did that i think i should put everything into replicanti i know that the best chance to go for is nine put the rest into um or not the rest but try to put a bunch into this and then maybe a few into replicanti galaxies uh, this is definitely cutting it very 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 close to the point where like um <laughs> I just don't I mean I could like how much would 10 replicated galaxies do I mean this may be the challenge I try to do over that 20 days of just inactivity because that means I can do like an extremely lenient replicanti interval here to the point where I can just do a ton of replicated galaxies That that's my strategy I don't think this is really possible at this point um, but yeah, and I'm gonna, now, now we're going to try Eternity Challenge 4. Yes, this means we need to grind the infinities. It shouldn't be that bad. Um, it's just, I think we can just go Infinity Dimension Idle. And I could try to go Time Dimension Idle. I'm not sure what is the best option here, but yeah, just go Auto Buyers. Turn this on and stay in a bit. Okay, we have grinded all of our infinities that we need. And now we will, um, yeah, enter the challenge. So, turning challenge four, I need E3100 infinity points. 
And 12 infinities or less, I mean, the 12 infinities or less is not a problem because we have 181. So, can we just get the required amount of infinity points? Let's see, I can get 28 replicated galaxies. So, hmm, this looks like another one that's kind of just a little bit out of reach. I mean, actually, this is going up pretty quickly, but we still need so many orders of magnitude that... Yeah, this doesn't look all that promising. If I'm getting 10 per replicated galaxy, I mean, that's 200 or orders of magnitude, but that puts me 100 short. So it's just bare. I mean, I could, you know, abuse this to get as many as 100 more orders of magnitude of infinity points. Could also, you know, galactic sacrifice to try to help further. And I mean, I am getting a, more and more um, you know, replicated galaxies here, so maybe it's possible, maybe it's possible in under 24 hours, because then I could, you know, go to Attorney Challenge 8, I'm, I'm not sure, this is, this is definitely one that's gonna cut it close, but this definitely is, seems like it's leaning on the side of being possible, rather than the other way around, so, I, I, that's what I'll do, I think, and I'm trusting myself that the infinity point doublers are going to do their job right and, you know, allow me to complete the challenge in un well, in enough times so that I can set up Eternity Challenge 8 next time. So you can see I'm up to max replicated galaxies. I'm really close to getting one more. Yeah, there is the one more. And we end up about 50 orders of magnitude away from the goal. So this is, unlike some of the other ones, this is definitely possible. Um, and I don't even need to, you know, get this multiple, is that, is that E20? That means I need it to be at like E80, you know, not even eight, E70, which, I mean, if I check the formula for, I'm not even sure what the formula for this is, but I think E70 is gonna be possible in just a few hours. So that, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna set this challenge, mostly, you know, gaining infinity points here, so if it does get slower, I can, you know, just gain more that way. And this challenge does have a really nice reward. I mean, it's, okay, it's dilation nerfed, but it's still a nice reward to have. And then I guess I can, I could just try Eternity Challenge 9, second time. Um, I'm not really sure. I mean, I also could try 6, third time. Because, like, with a couple more war rewards, it may be possible. But, yeah, we're just we're just going to wait a few hours and see where we are. And, yeah. And, and then I guess over that 20 days, I will do eight second time. And just, you know, get one Replicani Galaxy every day to be able to... Um, complete that challenge. So yeah, seen a bit.